Hey, this is Robert Waddington live here in Norwalk, California. Anyways, I just wanted to say that I went to the Jack in the Box uh, yesterday to go and get me, because uh, I had these coupons, right? I mean, I had these coupons. One was like a, uh, the ultimate uh, breakfast sandwich or something, you know, that has the egg and the sausage and the bacon and all that stuff. You get two of them for $5. Anyway, then I had a milkshake for like $2 or something, and uh, a six-piece chicken nugget or something, five-piece for a buck, whatever. Anyway, so I go into the drive-thru. Oh, no, no. First, I no, no. First, I went to the door that I parked my car, and I went to the door, and the door was locked. And I'm just like, uh, well, when did they start doing this? Because last time I knew, restaurants were letting people in and get the food and then get on out. But no. Uh, so I have to find out the hard way because nowhere on the door does it say the door is locked and you can't come in. So uh, what do I do? All right, so I get in my car and I got to go through the drive-thru. All right, and I hate the drive-thru because why? The drive-thru always screws up on something. But luckily I only had a, you know, a, a very easy order for myself. Okay, and so uh, uh, I, uh, I get to the drive-thru. I'm ready to hand my card and the coupons. And uh, the lady says to me, because, you know, this is how I looked, right? She says, uh, do you have a mask? And I was like, but I'm not in your store. Why would I need a mask? I'm in my car. I thought you only needed a mask when you're in your store. Just like when you go to Walmart or Winco Foods or wherever it is you like to shop at. Uh, anyway. So, and uh, she didn't say anything, and I didn't argue anymore because I don't want that to go any further than where it has to go because I'll never get to eat my food. You know, then I'll have to go and shop to another place to go get some food, and that's very aggravating. Anyways, I think you would understand if you would have been me in the past. So, anyhow, um, I just wanted to say that I gave the money and everything. All right, happy, happy, joy, joy. But then, uh, you know, I, I want to go to some of my favorite uh, Mexican restaurants and uh, and uh, Chinese uh, restaurants. Uh, and, and I can't go into those places because uh, they don't let you in anymore. And I love the salsa bar because I sat there and I just sit there and I douse salsa, especially the places I go to that I like their salsa. And uh, so I can't order their food anymore because it's... Uh, you call or you show up and you just say, hey, I want this and that. And then they give you like two little packets of salsa or something like that. And no, that doesn't work for me. I, for one thing, have to sit inside of a restaurant and eat my Mexican food and enjoy myself, right? And, uh, you know, with, the, with the, the, the Chinese food, I can I can go and get that three chicken, different types of chicken and the and the brown rice and the uh, and the chow mein half and half, right? And then uh, get that big old tub of a uh, uh, to go box and uh, take it with me, and then go home and then douse my uh, my uh, sriracha onto the uh, onto the meal, right? And no big deal, right? But you know what? I miss being able to go to a restaurant and just being able to sit there and eat. Uh, especially when it's Mexican food. Otherwise, I gotta make my own, which is fine because I like to make my own salsa, and and I will. But I just I don't like to take the time sometimes to do that. Anyways, I just wanted to say, uh, uh, oh yeah, and then I went to the uh, go gold panning a couple days ago, two three days ago, and I was up in the mountains. I was just just three minutes away from where I go uh, gold panning, or where I was going to go gold panning. And, uh, and all of a sudden, uh, uh, police officers are everywhere, and I'm like, what did I, what did I do, what did, what did I do this time, come on, man, come on, come on, man, you know, and so, uh, I pretty much, I uh, just wanted to say that, uh, I got turned around with about a million other people, so it took about, uh, about two hours to get back home, when it usually should take about an hour. So, uh, there is going to be no gold panning for the rest of this month, I'm pretty sure, until the fires are out. Uh, thank you for whoever started that fire, or whatever, however it happened. Uh, thank you so much, and I mean that sarcastically. Yeah. 
Anyway, so, um, I'm having a good day. I hope you are, too. Thank you. This is Robert Waddington, and I am out of here.